guys, today I would like to speak to you about pyrimidine and purine based production. As an interesting fact that glutamine is used in bodybuilding as a supplement. This glutamine along with carbon dioxide converts into carbamyl phosphate using carbamyl phosphate synthase 2 enzyme and 2 ATP. This carbamyl phosphate along with aspartate then converts into an orotic acid under three steps. For your high yield information, I can tell you that excess orotic acid in urine causes orotic acid urea. So guys, furthermore, this orotic acid along with PRPP converts into UMP using UMP synthase. After that, this UMP will convert into UDP. UDP will then convert into DUDP and CTP. CTP stands for cysteine triphosphate. Once uridine diphosphate converts into deoxyuridine diphosphate using ribonucleotide reductase, this DUDP converts into deoxyuridine monophosphate, DUMP. And then this DUMP converts into DTMP, deoxytimidine monophosphate. My friends, once DUMP is converted into DTMP, it's very important to know that phytin methylene tetrahydrofolate transforms into dihydrofolate and turns into tetrahydrofolate using dihydrofolate reductase. And then thereby tetrahydrofolate returns back as phytin methylene tetrahydrofolate. Ribose 5-phosphate from pentose phosphate pathway participates in both pyrimidine and purine based production. Let's see how. When ribose 5-phosphate converts into PRPP using PRPP synthetase and 1-ATP, PRPP as phosphoribosyl pyrophosphate with the help of glutamine PRPP amino transferase turns into enosine monophosphate which is IMP. Finally, IMP produces AMP and GMP and GMP utilizes IMP dehydrogenase for its production. Guys, I want to make this scheme much fun and easier for you. So I will recap this one using story based on Aladdin and the two evil twins. Where this will not erase from your memory almost. In the time of the pyrimidine and purine based production, nearby the pyramids there lived Aladdin who used glutamine as a supplement with carbon dioxide to transform into a V-shaped body carbamyl phosphate using 2 ATP and carbamyl phosphate synthase 2. Once he converted into a carbamyl phosphate, the V-shaped body, he went through three stairs up the pyramid to meet her lover Jasmine, orotic acid. And then she was leaving the castle holding a flower, which is a PRPP, and got on to a the camel's ump UMP using UMP synthase and during this time UDP saw this and summoned the UDP and CTP but UDP doesn't know that CTP is an FBI agent so UDP summoned the UDP using ribonucleotide reductase the UDP dumped her as the UMP that's how I say and in a, in a location called DTMP during this time, he needed some three documents for it. So therefore, I, he needed some document for it. 510 methylene tetrahydrofolate, which he converted into a dihydrofolate, which he needed also a stamp for it to convert into tetrahydrofolate, that is dihydrofolate reductase, and thereby converting into uh, the last document. Again, pasting at the back of the document, 510 methylene tetrahydrofolate, and no one doesn't know this and she's dead. When she was holding the flower, PRPP, she wished that I want to leave the castle. And then the genie who, who is called the Groot, he told, I am Groot. And then he pressed the button to kill the king. I am Groot. I stands for IMP. A AM stands for AMP. Groot stands for GMP. So guys, let's get into purine and pyrimidine synthesis inhibitors. They play important role in pharmacotherapy. Now, 
When we consider pyrimidine synthesis inhibitors, they are used in rheumatoid arthritis. For example, leflunamide inhibits dihydroarotide dehydrogenase. Methotrexate trimethoprim pyrimethamine inhibits dihydrofolate reductase. Hydroxyurea inhibits ribonucleotide reductase. When we come to purine synthesis inhibitors, they inhibit cell proliferation, especially leukocytes. So they are used in they are used as immunosuppressants in organ transplantation and autoimmune diseases. Now, for example, 6 mercaptopurine inhibits glutamine PRPP aminotransferase. Ribavirin and mycophenolate inhibits IMP dehydrogenase.